Disciplinary action has been taken against 10 officers and 33 policemen since 2014 for corruption related to smuggling activities at the country's borders. Those involved were denied promotion, fined and had to undergo rehabilitation process. Tan Sri Abdul Hamid said police are working with the Malaysian Anti-Corruption Commission to take action against those involved in corruption. Tidak ada isu tentang SPRM membuat pendedahan ini. Tidak ada isu berhubung dengan nak memalukan. Yang malu ni orang yang buat tu dan orang yang melakukan tu telah kita tangkap. Kita ambil tindakan. Warga PPJA yang lain yang berkhidmat dengan penuh jujur dan apa ni siang dan malam menjaga perbatasan itu tetap ya, akan dirahmati. The IGP also said it was not a good practice to rotate problematic officers from other units to the General Operations Force. Kesan daripada itu, daripada apa ni, tindakan menukarkan mereka, contohnya, daripada CID lah, ataupun pegawai-pegawai yang menyeleweng di dalam SB ini, masuk ke PGA, masuk ke PGA tanpa counselling, tanpa apa, mereka terus bersikap bertindak sedemikian. Tidak ada uh, satu kesedaran. Jadi dia inilah yang akan mempengaruhi pula warga PGA di sana. Khususnya kalau dia pegawai. Yeah. Tan Sri Abdul Bado said the police have requested the Home Ministry to add more men in the Integrity and Standard Compliance Department. This is to fulfill the need of the police force to increase its integrity. Yesterday, the MACC revealed video clips shot at the Malaysian-Thailand border showing rampant smuggling and corruption being carried out since 2017.